thankfully, a summer tail, thankfully. And while I do not have 5,000 peasants to, and, and to throw at you, there, the tail I will tell is of equally insurmountable odds. Back in the days of Holland Antiquity, Penzik, single digit so, hit question mark, somewhere in that area. It, it happened on the field, the field hold, hold, the woods battle was about to take place. Now, for those of you who may be too young to remember, the woods battle on, on these days took place in what is now known as the High Meadows, and one of the main major portions of this was a causeway. Well, the Benrahm army, as is so often the case at Penzik, found itself facing pretty much the entire known world that year. And the Benrahm army, army had to be arrayed to make certain that they were able to hold on to a flag. The battle point was simple. It, oh, it, was, it, is, it is only that whichever side held the flag at the end of the battlefield, at the end of the fight, would attain the war point. Now, the Midrun was outnumbered about four, five to one in, on, on this particular war. There was no way they were holding on to this thing. But, uh, but the king did his best, uh, 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 best to make certain that he was, uh, was able to protect this flag. He laid some of his forces to the right, he laid some of his forces to the left, and it came time for him to lay some of his forces to the causeway. He saw how, how which forces he had left, three of his finest knights. He went to the knights and said, my, my, dear, oh, my dear good knights, it is your duty to protect the causeway. The knights said, very well, your majesty, which forces are we to lay there? His majesty said, my dear knights, it is your duty to protect the causeway. Your majesty, the entire Eastern Army is going to be coming right at us. How in the world are we to protect the causeway? His Majesty then said the two words that one must never say to a Skadian in trouble, get creative. <laughs> <laughs> and so it came to pass that uh, these three knights had came up with an idea, an ingenious idea by which they could slow the entire Eastern Army. Well, they laid themselves, the cannon in the distance fired, boom! And not how long after that, I'll call that after dispensing with the Eldamirian forces in front of them, pretty much the entire our Eastern Army came, came charging up the causeway. And, and saw, saw before them a sight that has never been seen on the Pentic battlefield before or since. Well, laid before them were these three uh, were these three knights, with a pole in front of them, with one man sitting next uh, in, in, in what appeared to be a booth next to them. The, the knight in the middle said, "Stop!" to the entire Eastern Army, and then a miracle happened. The Eastern Army actually stopped. My lords, this is the mid-round toll road. <laughs> if any of you are to pass here, you must give us a toll hole to go through. We are demanding that you pay a toll in order to go through and continue this battle. The Eastern Army had seen many of things in their, uh, their, uh, their, their trials at Penzik, but never once had they uh, been told how to handle a toll road. <laughs> we had best, best talk with His Majesty about this, and the, and the men in the front went back to His Majesty. His Majesty is in the back basically saying the equivalent of, gentlemen, we were here to charge over the toll road. Why are we not charging over the toll road? Your Majesty, there's three knights up there, and they have a toll booth waiting for us. <laughs> uh, could we possibly have uh, something from the Royal Treasury in order to get, to get past this obstacle? The King of the East responded the way you expect the King of the East to respond to such a question. Kill them! <laughs> Needless to say, the entire Eastern Force charged straight ahead at the booth, and although oh, there was some fighting over the banner, that her, once they brought the pole arms out, things got ugly. One, oh, the gentleman who was actually sitting in the booth actually he found that the booth was only wide enough for him to get his arms up, but not reach his sword, which was outside, and, well, four pole arms versus one helm. I think we all know who that ends. So needless to say, they were wiped out rather quickly. But some time later, the entire Eastern Army saw its prize in front of it. The banner, with only His Majesty and three straggly, uh, straggly souls in front of it. The King of the East knew now was the time. There is our target, gentlemen. Charge on for glory! One step, two step, three step, boom! The cannon sounded in the background. And because of the Midrealm held, um, held it with only those four forces, they won the day. So the next time that someone tells you that, who, that it's not possible for anything to happen at Penzik, you tell them how a toll booth won, uh, won a war point for the mid-round. <laughs>